George Floyd's funeral was filled with music and praise. Our Chaz Miller caught up with one of the artists whose rendition of a classic caught the attention of everyone who watched. Hey, Chaz. Yeah, Chauncey, a change is going to come by Sam Cooke. It's one of the greatest songs of all time. Once the strings come in and that voice starts, it sounds as good coming out of my Alexa in 2020 as it did coming out of my grandparents' stereo in 1964. Unfortunately, a lot of the themes of a change is going to come are still existent today, which is why George Powell here at Fallbrook Church decided to put his spin on the Sam Cooke classic. Music is very powerful. It, it has the ability to uh, connect people. It was an honor to take the song, The Change Is Gonna Come by Sam Cooke and customize the lyrics for the George Floyd story. I started singing the song and the first line of Sam Cooke's version is, I was born by the river. And then it made me question, where was George Floyd born? Because that's what, you know, is going on. And so as I started um, researching, it just dawned on me to change all of the lyrics, you know, and tell his story. I wasn't expecting this. I put it up Saturday, 2.30, and, you know, in four days, it's got uh, 1.5 million views and I, over 60,000 shares. And, you know, I'm just, I'm just honored that I could do something to contribute to the movement. And, um, you know, I'm hoping that we can keep the George Floyd, keep saying his name. I'm hoping that we can uh, use what has united us in the world, keep that alive. I grew up in church and I went to rehearsals, you know, with my mom sat in the back and then I got drawn into the music and I started moving closer to the choir and to the musicians. I had the privilege of singing for President Obama, his Austin rally, as well as the wedding of Mattress Mac's daughter. And I also was able to sing um, right before Boys to Men on stage. And uh, those are some of the highlights of my career. Another reason this song is important to me is because of my seven-year-old daughter. My hope is that this song will inspire change so much that she could live in a world where racism doesn't exist and that she won't even know what racism is. That's a lot of views on Facebook. George Powell told me he was watching some of the George Floyd funeral coverage, and he actually saw somebody with a sign that had some of his reworked lyrics on that. So it is making an impact live at Fallbrook Church in Northwest Harris County. I'm Chaz Miller, ABC 13 Eyewitness News. All right. Thanks.